Welcome back to Hasbro's Hide. Just a quick video showing uh, the latest saga in the Aero Precision EPC 9mm AR. And so we had this case head separation. I think it pretty much had that figured out. And so we'd, I downloaded uh, greatly some rounds. Started well below minimums, worked my way up. And in fact, I was just shooting the first minimum powder charge for CFE pistol and had this happen. I don't know if you've ever seen that before, but that's out of battery detonation okay and uh so what we believe happened and tommy boy um 3334 is the one that, that caught this he watched the uh, video i showed on the live stream on uncle jim's channel and he says you know i think that you know your first shot fired okay the fourth shot in fact what it was fired okay and then it came home and bump fired or in other words it the bolt came all the way home hit the barrel, which it does on these EPC-9s, bounced off, and then detonated the round. And sure enough, that's what you're going to see in the next, the, the final part of this video. I'm going to show the slow motion video, done that, and you'll see a little puff of gas around the uh, ejection port with the bolt closed. And that's what's going on. So one of the suggestions here was to switch triggers. Uh, there's one possibility here that's going on. Um, and that we're not slowing the bolt back down far enough as it goes back, etc. And some other things related to that. So I have a new uh, CMC trigger made just for 9mm ARs. It's supposed to be optimized for that. And so we'll be putting that on as well. And um, trying that. And then maybe even adjusting the buffer weights. This is an aero precision. Everything but the bolt basically is aero precision. And I use their buffer and their spring. So it's a 308 spring and an 8 ounce buffer. So I hope that's not it because that's irritating if you use their recommended components and then you have this kind of thing happen. But I'll find out. All right. So I just thought you might like to see that. A little scary. I mean, not too bad. It was perfectly safe. It's just when I then opened the bolt and this fell out, I got kind of irritated. Um, so I thought you might like to see that. We'll look at the video right after this and then. We'll see you in the next video.